So we've already met one cardioid, r equals 2 plus 2 cosine theta. So now we're just going to look at them in general so you know how to sketch them. Now, a general form can be written as r equals a times 1 plus cosine theta, or it's the same as r equals a plus a cosine theta. Okay? So the shape of the cardioid looks like this. Okay, I mean, it's meant to be kind of symmetric and probably a bit more rounded here rather than it's, it looks kind of like a heart on its side, but it's not it's not a perfect kind of heart shape. It is kind of more curved there rather it's not really pointed. Okay. Now this is obviously when theta is zero and this is when theta is pi. You have this cusp. Okay, so it's referred to as a cusp at that point there. Now, uh, when theta is 0, cosine theta is 1. So you get a times 1 plus 1. So this point is 2a. And when theta is pi over 2, you get cosine of pi over 2 which is equal to 0, and so that is a there. And when theta is pi, cosine of pi is minus 1, so you get a times 1 take away 1, which is why you have it at the origin there. So this point is uh, minus a down here. So this is how we can sketch a cardioid.